use deterministic matches and we also use probabilistic matches. Our default method to establish links between devices is a deterministic match. Deterministic matching is when a partner of Lodemy's gives us, uh, for example, a, a user login or some other type of third-party ID that allows us to say with certainty the user who's using one ID on one channel is the same user who's using a different ID on a different channel. Let's say you're a publisher, you have a website, you have an app. Let's say you need your consumers to log in to access the website and you need them to log in to access the app. So you can pass the encrypted login ID that's non-PII based into our platform and we can use that encrypted login ID as the key to connect multiple devices used by the same consumer. Probabilistic matching uh, has the same goals as the deterministic matching, but in cases where we don't have any explicit uh, connection between IDs and records, we have to use signals uh, from those records that are specific to a particular number of devices in order to try to tie together records. We are using some advanced statistical analysis to identify relationships between different devices using some very unique signals. The types of signals we use are uh, contextual sorts of signals, uh, time, location, IP address. There are device level signals, you know, make of the device, model of the device, whether it's an iPhone, whether it's a tablet, whether it's an Android tablet, types of apps they visit, types of websites a user visits, etc. So when you combine all these signals together, and when you look at these signals within a 60 day time frame, you are in a position to establish a better and better linkage between two distinct devices. Accuracy is the rate at which when we declare matches in a probabilistic fashion, those matches actually turn out to be true links between IDs on one channel versus another from a known set. If we have customers who have known data sets like a login information or some kind of a unique ID across multiple devices, we compare our results with their known data set to publish an accuracy percentage.